Integrated rice duck farming is a unique and sustainable farming method that involves the simultaneous cultivation of rice and the raising of ducks. The ducks play a crucial role in pest control, weed management, and fertilization of the rice fields. Hello everyone! Welcome back to our channel. Today, we've got an exciting topic to discuss integrated rice duck farming. It's a sustainable farming approach that combines rice cultivation with duck farming to enhance productivity and promote eco-friendly agriculture. So, let's dive right in and learn about this innovative and harmonious farming system. First let's discuss how to set up an integrated rice duck farm. It involves careful planning, suitable paddies, the right duck breeds, and efficient management practices. First start with germinating and planting the seeds that come from last year's rice crop going through to raising seedlings in a nursery and tilling the rice fields and preparing them for planting. We have to plow the field thoroughly and level it to create an even surface. Proper leveling ensures an even distribution of water during the growing season. Flooding a field with water to a suitable depth is also important to make sure it's enough to support the upcoming rice crop but not too deep. Moving the flats from the nursery to the larger paddies and planting them out marks the end of the nursery period and takes us out to fieldwork phase where we start to introduce ducks into the equation and we're managing plants and water and animals on a much larger scale. Ducks have to be in the rice paddy for about two to three months. This is a method that's been known for about 3,000 years starting in ancient China and the REA sun it works is that ducks eat all kinds of plants and animals that are found in the paddy environment but they don't eat rice because rice leaves contain silica and ducks don't like the texture of silica on their bills so they ignore the rice and scour up everything else helping keep the paddies wheat free otherwise. The only ways we could weed the rice paddies would be through back breaking hand labor or the use of chemicals both of which are pretty expensive and chemical intensive which is kind of not healthy. Ducks also contribute to natural fertilization by excreting nutrient-rich droppings into the rice paddies. This organic matter enriches the soil providing essential nutrients for the rice plants, ultimately enhancing crop yields and promoting soil health. Integrated rice duck farming promotes sustainable farming practices by utilizing the synergistic relationship between ducks and rice crops. It reduces the environmental impact, conserves water, and minimizes the use of artificial fertilizers and pesticides. Mm -hmm. 
Now we are at the moment of harvest, and yeah the last time we were here, the fields were populated with ducks, and we removed the ducks so they've been out of this picture for a while. Up until the time we removed the ducks we continued to irrigate the field, but after that point it's advantageous to have the field to be dry for efficient harvest and the plants have big enough root systems that they can access all the water they need for grain development and ripening from the soil. Combines work following two steps first they cut the plants off from the base and they also thresh the grain off of the plant and this one is particularly sophisticated it's got a cutter bar in the front and all these little fingers that carry the plant into these slots turn it sideways and transport it backwards into the threshing chamber so that only the heads of the grain are threshed then it leaves the straw chopped on the field. Integrated rice duck farming is a beautiful example of how harmonizing nature with agriculture can lead to a more sustainable and fruitful future. Thank you for joining us on this enlightening journey. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more eco-friendly farming insights. Happy farming!